Okay, and now for the second part of our B-25J interview, we're going to talk to Jim Baker. He, he was a pilot on our flight yesterday. And so, Jim, on our flight, did we take off the way that the Doolittle Raiders did? Actually, the Doolittle Raiders did much more of a high-performance takeoff. Uh, they had a shorter, of course, off an aircraft carrier, they had a, a shorter uh, distance, so they made uh, uh, their takeoffs at a very slow speed. We don't do that for safety reasons. But it, uh, we do a standard takeoff uh, like a land-based aircraft would, so a higher speed. Okay, and I noticed back there, we're going to have a picture. This aircraft has participated in the Doolittle reunions. Can you talk about that? That's correct. Uh, yeah, every year, uh, years ago, the city of Tucson gave, uh, gave the reunion group a, a set of goblets. And the goblets were all, uh, had, had the, uh, the Raiders' names on there, um, right side up and upside down. Every time a, a raider dies, they turn the goblet upside down, and then, then at a point where the last two raiders are left, they will. Uh, there's a bottle of champagne with that, and they'll they'll drink a toast to the, to all the other raiders. Um, for years, they flew those those goblets around, and um, to the reunions. Now they're down at the Air Force Museum in in, in Dayton. This aircraft has the, had the privilege of uh, multiple times of, of flying those uh, those goblets to the reunion. And like I say, however, now they're all down at the uh, at the uh, Air Force Museum. So, what's it like keeping the memory alive of all every, all the planes, all the crew, whether they be pilots or not, that served in these craft? Well, to me, it's a real honor to do that. My father was a World War II veteran, and uh, um, you know, the greatest generation. We need to keep the memory of, of those fellows and the women alive that uh, that participated in the, in, in that war. And in, 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 in my opinion, to be able to do that, not only am I lucky, but I'm honored. And it's a privilege. So. Thank you very much. Thank you.